Hello friends. Welcome to our channel Vale Baba for Canadian immigration videos and news updates. In this video, we will talk about how NOC changes impact Atlantic Immigration Program AIP applicants. Watch the video till the end to get the full information. Please hit the like button, subscribe channel, and do not forget to push the notification bell icon for more upcoming videos and immigration news updates. Let's jump into our today's video. The Atlantic Immigration Program AIP is a federal program that allows newcomers to move to one of Canada's Atlantic provinces which are Nova Scotia, New Brunswick, Prince Edward Island, or Newfoundland and Labrador, and get permanent residence. Please watch our video on AIP, link of which is given in the description, which contains details about how the Atlantic Immigration Pilot Program works, details on what the program is all about, what are the eligibility requirements, and how you can submit an application to obtain Canadian permanent residence through this program. AIP was previously open to applicants with experience in jobs that require skill level C or above. Under NOC 2021, the eligibility cutoff changes to TER4. Due to this change, the following 12 occupations will no longer be eligible for AIP. Pet groomers and animal care workers, NOC 65220, previously NOC 6563. Other support occupations in personal services, NOC 65229, previously NOC 6564. Longshore workers, NOC 75100, previously NOC 7451. Material handlers, NOC 75101, previously NOC 7452. Taxi and limousine drivers and chauffeurs, NOC 75200, previously NOC 7513. Delivery service drivers and door-to-door -door distributors, NOC 75201, previously NOC 7514. Boat and cable ferry operators and related occupations, NOC 75210, previously NOC 7533. Livestock laborers, NOC 85100, previously NOC 8431. Nursery and greenhouse laborers, NOC 85103, previously NOC 8432. Trappers and hunters, NOC 85104, previously NOC 8442. Food and beverage servers, NOC 65200, previously NOC 6513. Laborers in textile processing and cutting, NOC 95105, previously NOC 9616. If you're in the process of applying for PR or are already in the express entry pool, you may be worried about how changes to the NOC system will impact your eligibility. However, the changes are primarily limited to terminology and classification and, for the vast majority of applicants, there will be no impact on your chances of qualifying for PR. If you're in an occupation that has become ineligible under Express Entry or AIP, don't worry. You may still be able to qualify under a different immigration program and move to Canada. Please visit the Canadian Immigration Official website. Thanks for watching. Please let us know in the comments section below what you think about this. That's all what we have for in today's video. See you in next video. Till then bye.